I'm Samantha Mewis. I play for the United States, and I'm a center midfielder. My name is Ali Krieger, and I play defender on the U.S. Women's National Team. I'm Julie Ertz. I'm a midfielder for the U.S. Women's National Team. My name is Becky Sauerbrunn. I'm a central defender, and I play for the United States of America. I mean, I grew up in St. Louis, which has kind of a soccer history, and so I grew up playing with people that had played on the national team or had aspired to, and I was lucky enough that I had a family that supported me and wanted me to play soccer. And so uh, in 1999, when the Women's World Cup was in the United States, uh, they took me to a bunch of games, and I remember watching the Rose Bowl game uh, and, and then winning and just thinking, like, I need to experience what these women are experiencing to win a world tournament like the World Cup. When I was younger, I doubted myself a lot and I kind of saw myself as small and I think that if I could share anything with a young girl it would be to take up space wherever you are and try and just kind of command a presence wherever you can. Um, I think it's super important to ask for what you think you deserve and um, work really hard to back that up. So just knowing that you deserve everything and um, to make sure you believe in yourself and set your sights high. I think we all are so successful here is because we just, you know, grab that energy from each other and everyone here wants to win and has a will to win and that drive to succeed in anything they want to do. The mentality piece I think here is most important because the, only the strongest mentally will survive in this environment and I really feel like we push each other, we support each other in that way to make sure that everyone is like mentally strong enough to just thrive under pressure and um, to kind of get through those tough times to be able to perform at our best. So I really think that we make each and every person here better and um, we're all under this like, you know, umbrella together and in this bubble um, that really helps us survive and, and be so successful and want to win. Be confident and authentic and um, live the life that you've always imagined um, by controlling what you're able to control, you know, through your work ethic and your attitude towards whatever that will be. I always say that adversity is your best friend because those are the moments that make you better. Um, there's so many ups and downs in your professional career um, that you learn a lot from, but obviously in those moments of hard times, it's kind of hard to, um, to see that and kind of see the light. So being really Staying true to who you are and using those moments to make you better. To just make mistakes and to, to not be afraid to make mistakes and to try different things and to push your level and you never know what your level is until you really like brush up against it and so I think people at a young age kind of get dejected by making mistakes and maybe not finding the success as early as they want to. And for me, I just want to let them know it's like it's a long-term game. It's you just gotta you work at it, you put your head down and work at it, and good things will happen for you. I really feel like you have to just go for your your dreams, your goals, and work really hard towards something, and you will be successful because that's what we have done our entire careers. We've put our mind towards something and, and set these goals of winning world championships and Olympics and um, playing at the highest level for a certain amount of you know years which is so consistent um, with with us and it's all because we put that amount of work into it and if you want to get to where you want to be you have to be willing to put in that work. <laughs> <laughs>